Hi friends, in the part 9 we have seen how to create the surfaces. Now in the part 10 we will see how to edit those surfaces. Merging, joining two surfaces, how to trim the surface, how to offset or extend the surfaces, how to intersect these two surfaces, these things we can see. Okay, first we are going to create two surfaces, extrude, surface, placement, and creating 200 by 100. side 100, bottom side also 100, both are captains, okay. Now I am creating one more surface, extrude, go to surface option, placement, sketch view, I am creating one arc. created one arc. it should entirely cut the previous surface okay now entirely cut now okay now we have created two surfaces now we will see how to join these two surfaces first pick both the surfaces by pressing the control button we have selected two then see here we can see the merge option see, merge each surface is divided into two pieces see in the vertical surface bottom one and the top one divided by the flat surface then the flat one divided by two inside the rectangle and outside the rectangle see now we have selected the grid one is the selected one bottom one we have selected as well as in the flat inner one we have selected see the preview we are getting the cut like this now i am changing the direction instead of bottom one i am changing the top one see like this we are getting now i am changing the flat one see similarly how we need based on that we can merge the surfaces okay now we have created the surface like this okay in the last class we have seen only the closed quilt can be converted into solid if it is a open or open loop we can convert into a thin solid see select this surface make thicken we can give the wall thickness 5 the thickness may be now the surface is top thickness added below the surface by flipping this see above the surface we are getting by flipping one more time in between the surface we are getting in this way we can get the wall thickness see this is the thicken option Okay, now I am deleting this thickening. Now merge. I am changing this into a. Okay, see. Now we we know very well merge. Next one we have to see trim. Trim means cutting one portion and removing. For that we have to create one more surface. I am creating one surface. We 
we have created one rectangle it must be beyond this okay sorry it becomes solid surface it may be a open ends or capped ends now we are going to cut the top surface this one we are going to cut this surface uh, we need to remove this portion of uh, surface from the bottom one so pick any one surface then we will get the trim option select one here select trimmed cult which is going to be trimmed one for us the bottom one is the trimmed one this is the trimming object trimming object is this one okay which portion you need no need to worry about the trimming object it won't play any role only the bottom we are working on that see outside the rectangle or inside the rectangle we have to choose see this one now we have selected outside the rectangle see inner side is open see? we can hide this surface also now for better clarity see we removed the inner one if we want to if we need the inner one go to edit definition flip this one and give ok we are getting this portion this is trim now we have seen merge then trim <coughs> merge we have seen thicken we have seen trim we have seen then the offset just I am deleting the trim this also I am deleting not required I am making this into outside ok then we will see the offset by picking pick any one surface and go to offset it will take the entire surface so remove this one which is not needed to be offset only the top means select only the top this one ok <coughs> see the direction see here 1 2 3 4 options are there first one is unattached offset this wall the new wall created by offset having no relation with the parent object see I'm giving 20 mm give ok see this is a separate subject uh, separate sur surface sorry even we can add the side walls also create side surfaces see? even though we have created a side wall this is a separate one we cannot create a closed one okay edit definition first one is always unattached surface second one is an attached surface second one is attached surface but we have to draw sketch for one particular portion only we can offset here the entire surface we can offset okay we will see one by one delete okay we just picking to the offset see remove this only top surface I am selecting the upper side okay we cannot solidify this I am deleting this instead of this we can inner one ok now we will select surface offset references remove and leave the top one ok now I am adding 20 mm ok by picking this we cannot solidify this 
even if we are adding side walls okay. now we cannot solidify this by selecting this check whether it is highlighted or not now i am deleting edit definition first one we have done the second one for the second one we needed to create some sketches see select the sketching plane references select surfaces this surface already selected one sketch we have to define sketching plane sketch i am drawing one more rectangle okay a b front see the rectangle we have drawn the those rectangled surface offsetted 20 mm see one option is there now the offset is normal to surface here we have drawn the sketch this is the surface the offset surface is normal to this one if we want normal to sketch means select this one see there is a difference okay now we have selected normal to surface if we need any draft angle on the offsetted surface we can provide hmm? like that go okay now select this one and give solidify we can do see okay this is a attached offset okay the second one we have third one is also a attached offset but a full surface then deleting this okay now select any surface go to offset remove this first select this one select the surface this surface okay normal to surface whole surface select here also you we can draw and offset whole surface means select this one here 20 mm go okay now become 20 mm higher now select this one and go solidify this is also a attached wall first one is the unattached one all remaining things are attached delete okay then i am deleting the offset okay now i am solidifying this okay now we have always we can do like this will be like this then i am doing thicken we can do 3 mm okay now i am creating one more surface in the offset you have to see the replace option for that i am going to create one extrude surface this one to define sketch view offset then now i'm offset here i am drawing one spline to the surface is like that it must be beyond the replacing surface in all the sides now see without surface it will be like this now we have created one more surface on the top now i am going to replace the bottom surface with the top one select any surface 
go to offset see in this last one first select this one select the surface okay this surface select the surface then we have selected the surface here also we can this is also a one of the selection tool which one we need to select we can select and pick this is a we have selected this surface go to offset now we can find the replace button see this is the replace the surface what we have selected to be replaced by a new one see replace cult we have to select the blue one view preview okay see the bottom one replaced by a top one the replace only works with the solid not surface with the surface okay now we have seen merge we have seen thicken we know trim offset full surface we can unattached as well as attached we have seen partial portion of surface okay replace now we have seen intersect curve creation now i am deleting the entire thing now we have two surfaces wherever the surfaces intersects we need the curve on that means select these two go to intersect see now hide the surfaces see on the intersection we are getting the curve by using the sweep option we can create some features now we have seen all the things okay thank you